Welcome back to the channel, folks. If you're here, you're probably dealing with a stubborn parking brake on your 2006 Nissan Wing Road. Well, lucky for you, we've got the fix. So, here's the deal. You took your car for a warrant of fitness test and guess what? It failed. Yep, the inspector noticed that the right rear wheel is engaging just fine, but when you pull the parking brake, the left rear wheel, it's just chillin', not doing its job. You know what that means. That's right, parking brake failure on the left side. Now, I didn't just sit there and cry about it, though I was tempted. I decided to fix it myself. So, off comes the left rear wheel and, drumroll, please, there it is, the culprit. The parking brake cable is all loose and floppy. Instead of connecting to the brake shoe lever arm, it's just hanging out, not pulling its weight. Let's break this down. When you engage the parking brake, the cable tightens, pulling the brake shoe lever arm, which in turn engages the parking brake and locks the wheel in place. But in this case, nada. No engagement. The lever arm isn't moving because the cable slipped off. The parking brake wasn't doing its thing, and boom. But fear not, because I got my hands dirty and fixed it. Here's how. I used some basic brake repair tools to carefully push the green parking brake cable back into the brake shoe lever arm. With a little patience and a bit of elbow grease, the cable was securely connected, and boom, parking brake fixed. The lever arm now moves, the parking brake engages. If this video helped you out, make sure to hit that like button, share it with your fellow car enthusiasts, and don't forget to subscribe for more easy to follow DIY auto repair tips. Got questions? Drop them in the comments below and I'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching, and good luck with your repairs.